it's Layla from Seven Kids Crazy, and today I'm gonna be doing a drawing video. I hope you like it. Today, what you're gonna be needing is a Sharpie for sure, but you could use any marker or anything you would want to do with. It doesn't even have to be a marker. It could do. It could be a, a pencil for now, if you'd like. And you could trace it later with a Sharpie or pencil or whatever. Or you don't even have to do, you could just leave it in pencil. But I use Sharpie. Okay, then you're going to need a sheet of paper. That's it. If I didn't mention, today we're going to be drawing a flappy-eared dog. Okay, let's get started. So, to begin, you need a Sharpie, of course, and your piece of paper. So, you want... The first thing you want to do is you want to make two circles right next to each other. It can be big, small, whatever size you want. Okay, so it should look like this. Two circles next to each other. Like that. Sorry. Okay. Then you want to take your Sharpie and you want to go this way from the top to the bottom, just like this. It may look a little weird right now, but like that. Then you want to put two little highlights over here. So two little baby circles. Just like this. Then, what you want to do is you want to take this and you want to kind of mark around the, like, draw around the circles. Here, I'll show you once I'm done. So it should look like this when you're done with that. Hello, Willow. Please get off the hard floor. Okay, sorry. If you hear the little tip tap, so that's my dog. Please don't bark. Don't bark. Sorry. If you hear barking, it's my dog, and I'm sorry for that. Anyway, um, so when you're done with that, um, she's staring something down in the window. <laughs> Okay, um, I'm gonna have to deal with that. Anyway, so you wanna make a little circle underneath the eyes. Just like that. Hold on a second, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, sorry about that. Um, anyway, so then you want to make two little circles inside of that nose. Like that. Okay. And then you want to do this. A little happy. Kind of like that. Okay. Then you want to kind of. How do I explain this? Make a circle around all the stuff you just did. Well, it's a little bit like, it's kind of easy to explain actually. Like that. So I'll just show you what that looks like. Like that. So it looks good. Okay, next. Next, what you want to do is you want to make the start of ears. So you kind of just want to go like this. Yeah. So that's the start of your ears. Okay. And you want to bring it down and kind of swerve and curve it. 
Bam, I took a bone. Okay, you wanna do kind of like the same thing on the other side that you did on this side. But maybe some ears of the dog are crazy, but um, that's basically what you do. I think I, I think I did this once on this channel, but I don't know. I'm just kind of recreating what I did, but a little bit better. Okay, next, what you wanna do is we're gonna make the collar of your animal. The animal's collar. So you wanna start right probably there. You don't wanna make the collar super big because usually on animals, the collars aren't super big. Just like that down area. Boom. And I am going to be coloring this, so. Okay, I am going to be coloring this, so, um, yeah. Um, anyway, so basically what you wanna do next is you wanna bring down the body. <laughs> of your character i did that so basically i want to do that like a little doll there we go okay you probably can't see me drawing it but like i'll show you after anyway so you want to bring that down just a little bit more so it's a little bit longer okay then you want if i'm going too fast you can pause the video to catch up then you want to bring down the hind legs like there. It's good. Okay. Then you want to do that on both sides. Kind of like spread it to the seam. Okay, this part gets a little tricky. Um, then you want to connect these two. Sorry I didn't talk for a little bit because I was focusing on the legs. I'm making them. This one's a little bit wider than this one, but that's okay because I can fix that during when I'm You could actually, if you mess up on that a little bit, you can make this line more like indented and then when you color, that'll totally disappear. So there. Okay. Next, what you want to do is you want to take the legs like right here and you want to go like this way sorry i messed up a little bit so that's why my face is escalated that's not the right word for that anyway i need to focus and i'm making it a little you don't have to do this extra lining. I just messed up on the front of her paws. You don't have to do this or this. You don't have to do this or you don't have to do like this part right here. Like the lines because I completely messed up on that because I wasn't paying attention. Also, uh, it's okay. I fixed it with some thicker lines. Anyway, this is our character so far. I love it, and I love how she turned out. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Um. Anyways. Okay. So basically, next we're going to put. <sighs> okay, we're gonna call her next. I no, actually, we missed something. All dogs have like the registration thing on them, which. We're gonna make okay. I'm back. Um, and I've got the coloring supplies, and then I'm okay. So take that out. We got all these colored pencils. No, not colored pencils. Pastels. Okay, so you can choose what color you want to make your dog. And this dog, I'm feeling kind of like a vibe of this color, yellow, and and kind of like an orangeish color and a brownish. This color. Wait, that's red. No, not that color. Like in this color. Yeah, that's red again. Okay. Hold on. And this color. Okay. So we've got three main topic colors okay so basically what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna like work on you guys use, use markers or normal like things but i feel like he she or he needs a kind of cool style so um, i'm gonna color it um this way and i might um fast forward this i'm going to fast forward this and editing uh this way so then i can you could actually see what i'm trying to do here so um yeah i'm gonna have this part fast forwarding with music okay i'm gonna fast forward in three two and three two one Ba 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 
done coloring um so this is what it turned out to be it's really cute and i love it, how it turned out like it's there is a couple things that i wouldn't recommend doing on your picture don't ask why there's a bunch of like fingerprints all over this because i had to erase and scratch off of all that stuff look at my hands like bruh if you're gonna use pastels Please wash your hands before you touch like the top of the paper. Oh my gosh, it's okay, couple. I really hope you liked this video and you learned how to draw little dog. Um, so and there's also uh, I so I can also put like a bow on top of her head if I wanted to. Um, so yeah, I hope you like this video and I. Hope you give this video a huge thumbs up and learn how to draw this really cool dog picture. That turned out to be a coloring fill, but is you can color this anytime you want or any color you want. And I hope you like this video. See you next time. Bye.